Welcome in everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm AC Kingpin 27 with you today in MLB The Show 23's Diamond Dynasty mode to take a look at our second big other program here in season three. The All-Star Week program is available to you. We're going to talk here about the MLB Draft, the Home Run Derby, and the All-Star Game all in one program here. A chance to bring a ton of players, a ton of stubs, some XP along this reward path, and an opportunity for you to bring, guarantee yourself one card from the rare rounds of those three packs. The Draft, the Home Run Derby, or the All-Star Game. So be on the lookout for that in today's video. Now before we jump into today's content, y'all, drop a like and smash the subscribe button. I will continue this video content series we've been running it. We've been running all year. We've been cutting program videos, season videos, conquest videos. Season 3 has added even more content to the list. We've got Team Affinity still to hit, you, hit the channel here. Uh, so a lot of content heading your way as we're diving into Season 3. So just be on the lookout for more heading your way. Now let's jump right in here and let's talk about this All-Star Week program as our reward path is littered with player cards and some cosmetic items you see here. An unlockable icon with the All-Star Game logo, a profile with the City of Seattle, our American League uniforms at five stars, our National League uniforms at seven stars, ten stars, first player card up on the bat is the third baseman for the Washington Nationals, the 40th overall pick in the draft, Yandy Morales. Now he can play any of the infield spots for Washington, so a 96 overall for Morales is a beautiful card for the Washington Nationals. 13 stars, going to earn you the shortstop for the New York Mets, the 32nd overall pick, Colin Houck uh, here, as he shortstop, second base, and third baseman for the Mets here. 15 stars, going to earn you a third baseman for the Phillies, the 27th overall pick, Aiden Miller, as he gets a 97 player card item. Miller can play third base and first base if you're grinding through these theme teams for Team Affinity here. You see you get a Louis, Louisville Slugger uh, American flag bat at 20 stars, and the first of our all-star game cards show up at 25 stars. Looking at Mets starting pitcher Kode Senga uh, for the, for the all-star game here. Not a bad card at 97 overall with that fastball cutter, forkball slurve, and curveball combination. Another pitcher at 30 stars, it's Braves starter Bryce Elder, as Elder gets a 97 overall player card item as well. You see here at 35 stars, you get the Dinger Hero Bat, and at 40 stars, looking at another starting pitcher. Mariners starter George Kirby also gets a 97 player card item here. So that's three pitchers in the All-Star Game program at 97. At 45 stars, 2,500 season XP, and the Orioles left fielder, Austin Hayes, gets an All-Star Game 97 overall here. Uh, 125, 106 contact. This Hayes should be able to bat the ball around the diamond and get on base for you. You see a show pack at 50 stars and our fourth All-Star Game pitcher, fourth 97 All-Star Game pitcher, is going to be starting pitcher for the Houston Astros, Framber Valdez. It's great to see Valdez get an upgrade item here in Season 3 and an All-Star Game card nonetheless here. 60 stars get you the brave second baseman ozzy albies as he gets a 97 overall in the all-star game program as well let's see uh, 65 stars get you the home run derby 2023 bat here uh 70 stars gonna get you miami marlins right fielder jorge soler at 97 overall in the all-star game program uh, 84 contact 124 125 contact left but 104 125 power on the solar makes this card a must-have for miami marlins steam team enthusiasts another 2500 xp available at 75 stars and the pirates closing pitcher david bednar as he gets a 97 overall in the all-star game program here 80 stars our last player available here is corbin burns the starting pitcher for the brewers Another starting pitcher, that's five starters, 97 overall for Burns here. Uh, another all-star game item here coming in at 97. At 85 stars, you're looking at Diamond Duos Pack 26, which gets you a chance at Kyle Tucker or Camilo Duvall at 99 overall for the all-star game, as well as those San Francisco Giants uniforms from 1923. Uh, 90 stars gets you the We the People Victus 243 Pro Bat. I love this bat. Always have, have fun with that one. 95 stars all right 95 stars is a, ch is a choice pack you need to choose one pack from either the draft the home run derby or the all-star game and you're just going to rip that pack so you're still going to get the random uh rare mid or base round on those packs so good luck to y'all picking those ones 
at 100 stars, you're gonna earn 5,000 XP and you're gonna earn a choice pack of any of the rare round players from the MLB draft. So that's Paul Skeens, Dylan Cruz, Max Clark, Wyatt Langford, the Home Run Derby, that's Vlad Guerrero, your champion, and Randy Arozarena, your runner-up, or the All-Star Game with that's Elias Diaz, your MVP, and Yandy Diaz. So we've got eight players available in this choice pack. Guys, let me know in the comments down below who you're taking if when you get to 100 stars with this choice pack here. Uh, let's see. I don't think I got any of the 99s um, from the draft pack. I really like the Arozarena, but I think we're taking the Elias Diaz at 99 because his 97 is out there in the reward path for season three. So I think I'd rather have his 99 over his 97. So that's probably where I'm leaning toward there. Now, how do you get those stars? You can play the moments. We've got a bunch of moments here. You see two stars for knocking out player moments, but there's seven stars for winning one game. You're going to play as the MLB draft squad. You're going to take on the future squad in a three-inning contest. Winning that game gets you seven stars. Some moments from the all-star game are in here as well. Hit home runs. Don't give up pitches. And they're also going to take the National League down three to two in the eighth inning. And you're going to have to come back and win the game. Play the final two innings of the contest and win the game with the National League for another seven stars in the program here. So a chance. Let's see if we can count this right. Four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 14, uh, 28 stars available in moments here if you can knock out all of them. There are missions as well. We have repeatable missions. 1 to 1,000 parallel XP needed with 2023 draft, 2023 home run derby, and 2023 all-star game players. This is repeatable. So every 1,000 parallel XP granted is going to earn you five stars in the program. Uh, 500 parallel XP with any hitters is going to earn you five stars. 500 parallel XP with any pitchers going to earn you five stars. A win against the Seattle Mariners on veteran difficulty or higher going to get you 10 stars. Now, it does say play versus computer, so that means you got to play a nine-inning game here uh, to earn these 10 stars. Uh, we've got 2,500 parallel XP with all-star program players. So that's any of the guys in the reward path for this program. So the Morales, the Hauk, the Miller, the Senga, the Elder, the Kirby, Hayes, Valdez, Albies, Soler, Bednar, and Burns available to you there for those 10 stars. You can get on base 15 times with 2023 20, draft players. That's five stars. You can tally 30 strikeouts with all-star game series and 2023 20, all-star series players for five stars. Tally 18 innings pitch with all-star game series and all-star series players. Uh, 30 hits with all-star game guys. And 10 home runs with home run derby players. That's what you're going to need to complete all of these missions here. You can play the all-star event. And you can, every win in the event's going to earn you one star in this program as well. And there's a conquest map. There's an all-star week other program conquest map that's going to earn you 20 stars upon completion here. Let's go talk about this. I'm going to show you what's available here. Uh, you see it here. We've got seven teams to take on. You've got the Braves, the Reds, the Diamondbacks for the National League. And we've got the Twins, the Rangers, the Rays, and the Mariners for the American League. And let's show you these goals here. So remember, stubs and XP available at almost every goal here. Goal one, 75 million fans going to earn you a show pack. Goal two, it's a habit pack. Uh, when you conquer three enemies, uh, that'll get you another 500 XP as well. Goal three, conquering the Mariners stronghold. Going to earn you a Diamond Duos pack 24. Uh, goal four, conquering all of the territories in the program. Going to earn you a Diamond Duos choice pack 26 there with 1500 XP. All right, so four goals here. Now, there's also going to be hidden rewards scattered around the map. I'm going to show you those on screen now. So make sure you guys know where the hidden rewards are so you can grab all the packs available to you. Good luck fighting through this map, and good luck fighting through the program. You guys should have no problem rocking through this All-Star Game program. Stay tuned to the channel for more, guys. You never know when San Diego Studios is going to bring something out. We're looking forward to uh, July 21st to see the July Tops Now program, the new mini season that's available. So let's go. Let's all let's all be ready. Start grinding here through this Team Affinity and through everything that's available in Season Three. As always, guys. I'm AC Kingpin 27. Have a great day. Stay safe out there, and I'll catch y'all next time.